Now next is elimination method. In this method, we have to eliminate or remove any variable, either x or y. Let us take an example. 3x plus 2y is equal to 5 and 2x plus 3y is equal to 10. These are the two different equations. Now, if I want to eliminate the variable of x, I have to take the coefficient of x only. That means 3 and 2. These are the coefficient. If I want to eliminate y axis, I have to take the coefficient of y. That means 2 and 3. Now, what we have to do is, we have to multiply both the equations. Since I want to eliminate x variable, I have to take the coefficient of x. I have to multiply both the equations with the opposite coefficient. Opposite coefficient, that means, since I have to remove x, so I have to multiply first equation by 2 and second equation by, equation by 3. Now, since 2 is multiplied, we have to multiply 2 with the whole equation. That means 2 multiplied by 3 will be, either you can write in this way, 2 multiplied by 3 will be 6x plus 4y is equal to 10. 6x plus 9y is equal to 15. These are the two different equations. Now, since I want to eliminate x, I have to change the sign. Change the sign, that means since positive sign is there, I have to write negative sign. Positive here, negative. Positive here, negative. Okay, that means I have changed the sign of second equation. Okay, sign of second equation, that means since positive sign and negative sign gets cancelled, that means I have eliminated the variable of x. Now, what is left? Plus 4 and minus 9. Plus minus is minus. That means I have to subtract 4 and 9. After subtracting both the terms, I will get 5y. Now, since 9 is a greater number and its sign is negative, the answer will be minus 5y. Clear? Similarly, if I subtract 10 and 30, I will get 20. And since 30 is greater number, I have to write its sign, the number which is greater uh, as the sign. Okay? I have to write the sign. Uh, of the number which is greater. Okay? Now after solving it, since I have to find out the value of y, minus 20 upon minus 5. Now y, 5 in denominator because I know, we know that multiplication changes to division. Okay? Divided, divided, after dividing both the numbers, 5, 4 is 20 and minus minus gets cancelled. So we will get 5. Therefore, I got the value of y. Now, Next is the value of x. Now, in order to find out the value of x, I have to substitute the value of y in any of the equation, either in first equation or in second equation. Let me substitute it in first equation. 2y equals to 5. Now, y, instead of y, I have to substitute 2 into 4 is equals to 5. That means instead of y, I have substituted 4. Now on multiplying, 3x plus 2 4 is 8 is equals to 5. Here, now we know that as now I have to uh, shift the number to the other side of equality. That means 3x is equals to now y minus 8 because according to transformation rule, positive sign changes to negative sign if it is transposed to the other side. Now 3x is equal to 5 minus 8 is 3. Greater number is negative, the answer will be minus 3. Therefore, x will be minus 3 upon 3. Again, multiplication changes to division. 3 and 3 gets cancelled. The x key value will be minus 1. Okay. In this way, we got different values of x, that means x equals to minus 1 and y equals to 4. By this method, elimination method, I have taken out the values of x and y.